Hey everyone, welcome back to our Excel series. In our previous video, I have shown you how you can delete multiple sheets and rename worksheets. In this video, I am going to show you how you can insert an image in Excel. So the first question is, why do you want to insert an image in Excel? If I am about to answer it, then it would go something like this that uh, I want to show some pictures in the background of my dashboards. That's why I would use pictures or the another answer could be is that you want to show some small thumbnails which could be a clickable thumbnails. It totally depends upon your requirement that why do you want to put pictures in Excel. But most of most of the people they they do they do put pictures in their Excel dashboards and when you create beautiful dashboards you need to have few thumbnails uh, in order to show the user what exactly they have to do or what exactly a particular graph or chart uh, is supposed to provide the information so let's go and see how you can insert an image so I am on my Excel sheet I will create a new worksheet sorry sheet and let's go so if you see under this insert tab you will have this option of pictures right and there are two options available within this picture is to is the first that whether you can import an image from website or you can import an image from your local machine so I'll show you both the first one insert picture from this device so if you click on this small arrow or drop down you will get these two options this device and online pictures so first I'll go through this device if I click on this device then you will directly come to your pictures location folder pictures folder I'll click on screenshots and I'll select a particular picture and click on insert and the picture is inserted right now if you want to resize this picture you can do it like this then if you want to format it in another way there is an option under this format tab and you can use multiple picture styles so this is the shadow style and there are multiple options available here it totally depends upon your requirement and you can change it as you like it okay now let's go to the second option how you can import an image from website so again we'll go to insert we'll go to pictures online pictures so this will open this option for you either you can browse pictures from onedrive or the bing search so i'll use bing search here data i'll search anything here i can search anything and once you search it you will get a lot of the images that you want again you just need to select on any image if you can you can also select multiple images here but uh, i'm selecting one only then click on insert one and the image will be inserted here so that's pretty easy right if you want to import an image you can do it in this way so we have reached at the end of this video in next video i'll show you how you can use filters in excel hey if you find this video insightful then do check out other videos and hit the like and subscribe button